What's going on guys? Trade Confident Family, Travis here. If my video skips to the bottom right, I apologize. Um, I've got like 24 tabs open here trying to track these markets. All right, I wanna do something for you guys today. Uh, we've never done this type of video on YouTube before. This is member only content. And I've been going over this with our members and I'm trying to address this you know, question that you probably have watching this. You know, Are we gonna see a drop and how big is it gonna be? Should you be scared? Well, I'll tell you guys, and I'll show this to you in this video, you should be expecting from the peak of $49,000 where we reached, you should be expecting between a 30 to 50% drop. This is based off historical data. Now, I want to start this video by saying this. You know, I'm going to make some claims in this video, and I'm, I'm going to start with this saying, I think Bitcoin is easier to trade than most of you are making it. I think it's hard for you guys because you are doing two things uh, potentially inaccurate. I don't think you're on the right time frame, and I don't think you're using the correct chart. And so I kind of want to just, if I can, just give you guys, you know, just these free resources today and show you a study using a naked chart. It's not as scary as it sounds, <laughs> you know, and prove to you guys that Bitcoin moves in cycles, predictable cycles, every single having event. So we're going to start here. You guys are right with that? If you guys want to get into our membership, watch me teach you these type of things twice a week, Tuesday and Friday. There's a link in the description. It's the first one you guys can click there, and I'll show you at the end of the video as well. Let's start here. Everybody pull up BTC USD. I know you're obviously probably watching this on your phone or your computer. Do this later. Pull up Bitcoin. Come down to the bottom right. I know my face is covering this. It's a little hexagonal shape. Most of you guys are on the regular charts. You guys need to switch over to logarithmic. Now you guys are like, oh, I know about logarithmic. Okay, we, pr we probably don't know about this next one. The first thing I encourage you guys to do is get off the four hour and daily time frames. Get over to the weekly time frame or even the monthly. I'm gonna actually be pulling the monthly in today's chart. Get over to the monthly time frame or the weekly, get on those higher time frames, 30,000 foot perspective, and get on the logarithmic chart. All right, setup number one. Number two, I want you guys to get a Fibonacci retracement. And I'm just gonna pull this over here so you guys can copy this exact setup that I have. I want you guys to turn on zero turn on one, turn on 786. And the 786 in my case is red. I've changed this to red here. Do not have anything else on for the Fibonacci. Turn everything else off. There should be only three parameters, zero, one, and 786. There's a reason for this and you'll understand it needs to be crystal clear the data you're about to see because it's gonna unlock something for you like a light bulb of saying, oh my gosh, this may actually be programmed and I didn't realize it. All right, now that you have that set up, I want you guys to follow me on a very simple study that we can see in the market here. We're gonna pull up an indicator called Bitcoin halving. If I can spell here, that would be awesome. <laughs> okay, Bitcoin halving events. This is gonna mock up one, two, and three. Obviously the fourth one is coming roughly April 20th of 2024. What I want you to do is take that Fibonacci that we just created, one more point, my apologies. Go all the way down to the bottom and turn on Fib levels. Do not miss this step. This will not work if you do not turn this on. There are steps to re realizing the secrets in the market and these are the steps you need to take. Turn on Fib levels based on log scale. Not hard, just follow along here. Next, what I want you guys to do is take this Fib and I want you to go to the high and I want you to go to the low. You are going to realize, spoiler alert, that in every single halving cycle, price action is magnetized to the 786 Fibonacci retracement, every single time. The first time we had this was on halving event number one, 2012, where price action made a high, it made a low, and it came back up and magnetized to 786. The second time, is it possible that this, this could happen again? Well, let's find out. Let's go to the high, let's pull the low, and exactly at 786, price action stopped and turned to the downside, okay? Let's look at this on having cycle number three. Could it possibly happen again? Yes, it does, and it happens exactly to that point. Go to the high, go to the low. Exactly at 786, you reach the peak of the cryptocurrency market before one of the largest drops down we've seen. This is COVID. Side note, please do not pull COVID price action into your future analysis. This is a black swan events. Black swan events should never be pulled into the future. They are anomalies for a reason, okay? Every single halving cycle you have seen Bitcoin go through, if you have realized this or not, price action has magnetized to the 786 and then moved back down. I'm gonna give you one piece. There are a lot of pieces within this that are programmed, which I'll say for you guys if you're members, watch the last future forecast we did this morning. It's on the website. I'll talk about that at the end of this video. This is one piece of programmed 
price action that I believe is going to be repeating almost every cycle. And I don't think this cycle is any different. Why do you think, listen, why do you think Bitcoin stopped at $49,000? Do you think that was just a fun area for Bitcoin to stop? I don't think so. Let's get out the Fibonacci retracement. Let's go exactly to the high and let's pull the low. And what happens? Exactly again, exactly again at 786 is the exact point where Bitcoin stopped and it moved back down. Listen, just as it has in every single halving cycle. This is what we are teaching our members. You are probably not going to see a lot of this on YouTube. I, when I say we save content for our members because we curate so much data, this is specifically what I'm trying to show you guys. There are patterns that are repeating that I believe are quote unquote, call them secret patterns. If that's too cheesy for you, that's fine. You can pick another name. There are these secret patterns that are repeating over and over and over again. Okay. The drop has been predicted every single time as well. And I'll show you guys that data. I wanted to come on here and just give you guys this little glimmer of hope with this light bulb where some of you guys may feel like I don't have a control on this lion. This beast of crypto seems too unpredictable. And I'm here to tell you these type, not, not just this one, but these types of patterns replay over and over and over again. I will show you guys about three or four of these type of patterns in our future forecast. So I'm going to unshamefully walk you guys through a quick process of how to watch these patterns unfold by letting me teach this to you in our membership, okay? This is tradeconfident.io. I'm logged in right now, and so I, I apologize about this. I should probably pop this up on a different screen. At the top right corner of tradeconfident.io, it's going to say subscribe. You guys can click the first link in the description. Once you're logged in, we charge $59 a month. I'm not hiding anything, straight up front, $59. Go to future forecast, and watch this morning's future forecast. I will show you this setup I just showed you. I will show you how we're gonna time the bottom. I will show you where 10 million, excuse me, $10 billion worth of long trades sit, where the next bottom for Bitcoin is most likely gonna come right at that point. And I will show you guys multiple studies of these predictable patterns that happen over and over again. And then I'm gonna end the video by showing you guys why the altcoin season is coming next with a similar pattern as I'm showing you now. Once you can see these types of patterns that repeat over and over and over again, you're going to realize that crypto is more programmed than most of you think. It is an absolutely light bulb moment that comes on when you see, oh my gosh, it's happened every time. And this is one small piece of programmed price action, I believe, that Bitcoin has, all right? Is it a guaranteed drop that we're gonna get? No, I don't think it's guaranteed, but I side personally, you don't have to agree with this, but I side on the one of the best ways to predict future price action is to put weight on what has happened in the past, maybe about 80% out of 100. But that 80% out of 100 needs to be quantified with quality. So what kind of quality data do you have based off the 80% out of the 100 that we have a predict in the future? That is what we focus on. Quality data that shows past predictive price action patterns that could be projected into the future. That I think is the best way to predict crypto. We were able to use an indicator that we have at the bottom here. We ended up, I'll show this to you guys real quick and I'll end this video, this is getting too long. We were able to put $100,000 into Bitcoin on this buy signal because the top and bottom finder that we have on our website has beaten every single on-chain metric analysis indicator. It has predict every single top point before massive moves back down and has given us some of the best dollar cost average entries and predicted every drop in 2023 before it happened. It also is predicting we get a drop right now. This indicator is called top and bottom finder. If you want this, you can grab it yourself. Under indicators, go to the bottom down here and here you go. I'm gonna end this video here because I think this is long enough, but I just wanted to show you guys, this is what we're going over with our members. I walk our members through this and I take it a step further. I actually show you guys a risk management strategy that we're gonna to use to buy into this market. So we set ourselves up to hedge a drop on Bitcoin, but also expose ourselves to the altcoin market that's coming because the altcoins are about to explode in this next cycle. I'll leave you with one more nugget here. I know I'm continuing to go on. Listen, the altcoin market will blast when Bitcoin price action goes up while at the same time Bitcoin dominance goes down. Because when Bitcoin dominance goes down, the money is shifting to different arenas. It's gonna shift from your blue chip Bitcoin, and it's gonna to shift to your altcoins. Again, the altcoin will take off, and I'll show you guys how to time this, when Bitcoin price action is going up 
and Bitcoin dominance is going down, which results in alts going up with Bitcoin because Bitcoin's the rising tide, but then also your dominance of alts are gonna go up at the same time. I will explain all of that in the video that I just did this morning. That is over on the future forecast on uh, January 19th. All right, guys, I love you. God bless you guys. I hope you got something good out of this and I'll see you guys in the membership and I will come out with a brand new future forecast on Tuesday as we continue our analysis in the crypto market. I'll see you guys later and have a great day and I'll see you guys in the membership. Bye guys.